Hey, how you doing, Miss Nupu? I'm doing pretty good in yourself. All right. Uh, happy yeah. New Year. You sound... Well, happy New Year to you. <laughs> I, I told you to call me back in five minutes. You almost went into my lunch time, my dinner. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's I, all right. It's okay. I'm so, just making... What's up? Nothing much. You, did you get my message about um uh, Seepoo? Yeah, I sure did. How did you get in contact with him? Um, well, this the same way we had um looked up your information. I, I wrote him a letter and um I sent it out, but I didn't know he had passed. And then uh, a newt, which I told you about the other can, he stay in Queens, and so he decided just to go out there and, and, and see if he was home and just leave a letter. And he left a letter in the little drop box, and he met someone coming back that said that they hadn't seen him in a while and he drove he drove a truck or something and so he left and, and um the I guess the nephew or something uh called a newt maybe a week or so ago and said that uh he he passed and that he was cleaning out the house and he had like a, a uh, I think a, he had like a stroke or something something like that oh. it was like a heart because I remember, I remember you telling me that they they health wasn't all of that so right 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 so i, I we've so i didn't know to what extent at that time i don't think you had a stroke but i don't know right so when i tried to reach both of them the, the numbers were 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 in the order but i didn't want to call them because they were both in the hospital right right yeah we just wasn't trying to you know press too much we just gave it time and you know, just tried to space everything in between what we were trying to do ourselves and, and you know, so we felt bad about that. But the nephew told uh, Anut that he would uh, um, give him uh, the writings that Sipu left and that he would try to get in contact with Gipu. He said he knew Gipu's stepson and uh, they was kind of tight and he would try to uh get in contact with him we just wanted to you know sit down with him and and you know just get information like just like get caught up because you know we you know we we understand what they was trying to do and we we don't see any other not saying they don't exist we just as far as us messing around in the public with other people who's who's following the same signs that your husband laid down, it's it's only a handful of us that are serious to try to keep it going. And so we have a couple of things that are like missing, certain links, you know, certain questions like a lot of the words. What, 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 what do you need? What, what is missing? Well, what, what, like, uh, I, I don't even have my, my notes. I just call you on a humbug. But like, it was a lot of words in book three. We just would, wanted to know if there was, did, did, did your husband translate what they mean like omnibasal and it's a lot of new words that's in book three we you know we're trying to reason them out but you know we just wonder if he left notes to what these words really meant and stuff okay, like wait, wait a minute i want you to spell one of the words out for me and let me see here what you're talking about okay I'm gonna get my glasses on. okay okay about. Okay, um, I'm gonna do it from memory and then I pull out book three while we're talking. Omni Basel, I think it's O N O M N. Uh, yeah, O O M N B O Z uh, L L. If I'm if I'm correct, I'm trying to pull it up right now. And I got book three in front of me. I'm trying to pull it up because I had this stuff. Sitting here for a couple of months, I done misplaced my note because I wanted to ask you about that. It was just a couple of words throughout book three. Well, like I said, you know, most of the stuff I wouldn't know, but those are my husband's writing, right. you know. Mm -hmm. And so, um, yeah, I mean, I don't know if he left any notes or anything, but it must be something in the book that gives you some kind of idea or is a symbol. Yeah, we. Uh, are you sure it's the way it's spelled? I've, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking so. Hold on, let me pull up. Let me put it up on my computer, real quick. I read that book, and I, I, right now I don't even remember seeing this word. Yeah, hold on, I'm gonna give. I'm gonna give it on my hand, but I, you know, I, you know, been real busy and still, right. I still am. So. Right, I know. Um, right, so let me take this phone call here. Yeah, I was just trying to. I know you got a, got you, got your life too. So, uh. Let's see. Well, it's just this 
spirit just trying to, you know, to just stay alive and just keep up with everything, stay mm-hmm. on top of things, and you know, oh. just. You know. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. It's it's in here one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine times. And okay. the word the first the way it's spelled is O M N O B O Z L L. Right. So, um, I'm no Bonzo. I, I, you know, is, is, is it talking about numbers? Like, well, what, well, a lot of, like, like what preceded, he said, listen to sound right reason. The first time it appears is on page 17. And so he said, the noop, of course, supports the positive by turning counterclockwise, the turn of order and peace. And this is what makes the top half of the order circle heaven and home of flesh and blood gods. And goddesses of the universe during the time that the top half exists. Then he got brain newts. Then he have magic doctiles called omnibasal. And see, it's in this stuff like that. And then he got other big words too. Like you, we can, like we know that omnibasal can mean either it can be brain newts or magic doctiles. But when you when you look at a word, you want to like, okay, well, what does you know omnibasal? mean in universal language because i know he's just telling us you know because you can because he, he when he introduced magic doctiles that's another way to say brain news because we know they're magic matter but then he used the term omnibasal so we just wanted to know it's like a lot of words he has there that did you look at any encyclopedia and uh y- yeah we we and, we have me well, i know he has a book he has a couple books so i get like the book of the dead and We and know. So, yeah, I will have, have to study and study and so I got crazy for this. So mm-hmm. I, 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 you know, I can't help you with that. I, I really can't. Uh, I, you know, I just don't know. Right. Uh, just be honest with you. So you just have to, um, you know, keep on until you get. I think you may, you're probably on the right track because if you're reading the book and you're following it, then it has to be whatever you probably think that it is. I mean, that would be mine, you know. Right, he tell us to reason it out, and, 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 and we going through t- trial and error. The first thing we got out of this, this, this particular word, because this other ones, I, I know it would be harder, because we know that um is is, is similar to the, uh, the, 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 the sound that the Hindus use, om, and then aum. And then we know that then you take the word om, omno, and you can place it with an I. Omni means all. And we know that Basel, we, we, we reason that it could be ball. And we know that the smart circle is like the all ball. Everything and all is in it. So certain things we was able to kind of, you know, work with with that. So, you know, but it's, but it's other words. Like I said, we've been jumping around in different things. We we, we, meet, we working on books together, me and new. And we just would like to be able to have, you know, a lot of clarity in a lot of areas. And so we know that certain things that we can get through inspiration, revelation, but we know that a lot of stuff would be easier if we was able to like read some of the stuff that he had that that's that wasn't put in the books or even talk to, you know, uh, Gipu and Sipu. Well, you know, I look around and see, um, you know, what books I have, and if I see something uh, with, you know, some information I might need to use, then right. I, I will probably call you back. Yeah, you it's, know, and let you know. Right. You know. It's not a problem. Well, um, I can't, 
you know, I know I can't do it today or tomorrow. Uh, mm-hmm. First chance I get, cause I'm, I'm just backed up with stuff I gotta do for myself. Right, myself, right. You know? Right, not a problem. What happened um, with the, uh, with, cause I still was waiting on you, to, you know, you said you was gonna get the uh the nine ball and stuff to me and and we was going to peep in it too because i we wanted to definitely know uh about that word nawapo we've been speaking to different people some people saying that uh sun Ra actually brought the word out and was passing it out in front of uh in his his concerts and another uh ex nawapian said that it was a word from Jamaica, from the, the the Maroon people, who it meant freedom. We just wanted to get clarity on it because we know that that, like you said, your husband wrote the nine ball, and so we want to be clear on on this word because it's too much confusion with the Nawapians and people just running behind, and they, and it's just a bunch of mess. We want to know who put the word there. Did your husband use the word Nawapo? And if not, we would want to know what would be in the place what the word Nawapa would be in the a nine ball that you have so I can look at the, the nine ball that I have. Well, I, I, I think that was a beginner's book. I don't think all of this will be in there. Mm-hmm. Uh, I, I don't think. Uh, you know what, let me go see if I can see this. I'm going to see if I can see this book right off hand. Hold on. Hi. Yes, ma'am. How to, basically the the universal language works per se. You, you, you some words you 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 can combo, and that's the part of the new language. Uh, he was saying it, it, it will come in time. It's, it's um it's not easy. It's, it's it, it depends on how whatever the time and season is for something to come out. Usually when we we're writing together, uh, what me and Anu are doing. Um, Definitely, we we figuring out the uh, the pygmy gods, the temperature of the planet at that time, 18 million years from now, and and we got a number because I worked on it like in 2012, but I didn't have, I was doing so much stuff. But when I ran into him, you know, he definitely sparked a lot of questions, and then I was like, oh, I remember I got crazy notes on this, and so I would take stuff out of my um out of my room and my my little bins that you could put clothes in. And I just give him some of my notes and drawings. I got. You ever talk to my husband? No, ne- I've never had the 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 um the uh, the pleasure of ever speaking to him because I came to New York in 2008. And so that's why I was saying up under 2008 until we made contact with you to officially officiate that they were two different people is why you know things were on hold for a lot of time. And so now that we know they're two different individuals, it changes. 
our perception about things and it was like i say it was hard for us to know because you know york was under so many names and and like we do a lot of research now we find that he did a he not only did he assume other people's names he assumed the writings uh york was into a lot of mystic orders uh uh negative uh black magic type stuff and uh and i'm able to see that a lot of symbols he used he was using that to cast spells on people and that's why a lot of folks couldn't pin down exactly what he was doing and so like afro said in the uh in the uh the transcripts you know playing around with that that black magic and stuff or even ghost magic has his negative uh, effects and so he's in jail because of a lot of things that he was doing and so that's why our research is taking us is do we want to break the spells like he said that you to break the spells with new point noon is using sound right reason and the proper words to uh, help people understand once we explain like what a word in the wapu come from it'll take the mystery out of it because they keep thinking the wapu's think the wapu is a divine word and they don't know where it come from. The three names on the nine ball books, uh, Asanupu, Navanupu, and uh, I think Wunupu, they thinking that's three extraterrestrials from somewhere that helped York write them books. We know he didn't write the nine ball. Even before we got the confirmation from you, we still knew from looking at the writings from back then to the nature books, they consistent. And York didn't follow certain things like the nine Nuba guides that uh Afrunu put in the uh in the nine ball I think book four about being with your own race or the opposite sex. You know, York was into doing he didn't he messed with Chinese women, all kind of stuff, plus the the child molestation, all that type of crap. So we knew his character didn't fit with just what the books were saying themselves. But we know that a lot of our races under actual spells, like the Bible interpretation starts off with, there's a spell on the Ethiopian race. And when you get into spells, you have to know that these people use symbols and, and music and tones and all these different type of things. And so we just want to help our race by giving the information. We can't make another person intelligent. However, we can at least produce 100% facts that what they thought was wasn't and so that's one of the important things we wanted to get our hands on on the uh the original bible interpretation and the nine ball books just so people can see that if that word the whopper was there we would still want to know how where did it come from and if it's not in the book then we would want to know that means that somebody put another word there and replaced it and so these are little things that need to be known and i, I wanted to know because they also they said that it's nine parts to nine ball but it's only four been out. I don't know how true that is, but I've been hearing that over the years that that there was actually nine parts to the nine ball books that never was released. So, you know, it's, it's just little things like that. Right, that's, I know my husband did one. I don't, I, I, I really can't say about right. uh, you know, the nine ball books. Yeah, I really can't say about right. the rest of them. Right. I, I, I don't know. I don't, he never told me he did nine. I know. He has, I know that he has one. I can't say about the nine or four. Right. Or you know, I, I, I really can't say. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You know, I know he did a lot of writing, but I, I think he just did one of those. I think, but I'm, I'm not for sure. Right. I say, I, nine, nine has been so, so long, and right now, I, where, where I have it, it's a lot of stuff there, and I can't move it uh, to get the... Uh, to get to it, right. I, I think where it is, I think. Well, I have a book here, The Children of the Sun. We got some here, The Ancient, Mysterious, uh, Nakaziki, you know. Uh, Hold on, spell that? Here. Spell that? What? The, the Ancient, ancient Mysteries of... Okay, oh, that's Melchizedek. Is that, is that one of your books, or... No, this is a book that I think he read or whatever. This is, it got in the... It, yeah, it probably had a long time. I, I don't know. Is it a black book? It's like, by Navy. It's, it's by Navy Marshall Lewis. Okay, Navy Marshall Lewis. Okay. Hold on. Na Let me write... N-A-V-I. Okay. N-A-V-I. Marshall Lewis. M-O-S-H-E. Oh, okay. Hold on. Oh, by Moshe. Yeah. Okay, Nav Naya or Navi? N A V I. 
Okay, Moshe Lewis. Neva Moshe Y as in you, Lewis. Yeah, this is a book. Uh, you know, I don't know what's in it. I mean, it may not be. And see, all scripture quotation used in this book was taken from the Holy Name Bible, containing the Holy Name version of the Old and New Testament, critically compared with ancient authorities and various manuscripts. Like I said, he used to use a lot of, you know, read a lot of books and, you know, so I don't know which one, you know. Right. Uh, he got his, uh, you know. Navi Moshe Lewis. Uh, and I know he used to go to uh, the library like a day and do a lot of reading. Yeah. yeah, his nephew spoke a uh, uh, like what Sipu nephew was saying about they all used to meet up at the at the the Bumblebee spot and converse. Yeah, he had a store. Yeah, he had a store years ago. Yeah, and he called the Bumblebee. Yeah, and he said they was meet there for all the time, and they really was trying to help black people. He said Sipu was really good with computers, and uh, they was help start a lot of business and things like that. So. Oh, uh, that was Sipu when mm, it died. Yeah. So when did uh, when did Sipu saw him last? Um. Did you happen to get Did you happen to get Sipu's telephone number? No, ma'am. That and that's what we were trying to do. We 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 only know that he said he knew the nephew said he knew where the stepson is at, but you know we don't know. We don't want to be in the in the in the in just holding on. Like it's like as soon as we find out where somebody's at, they're gone. And so it's that's you know that's that's really a bad. Well, one thing they they, they weren't uh, as I told you they were not known in the public. They did not care to be you know they just want to get the message out. Mm -hmm. They weren't interested in anything else but just get the message out, and then you just take what they give you and that's it. You know, Cause, and I'm not even the writer of the book. You know, right. so I can help you very little. Like I say. Uh, I just know, you know, because I don't even do this stuff all the time. We, write, the, we the same write way. And write and read, mm -hmm. write and read, and write and read. We the same way, and I'm pretty sure if if Geepu was, you know, gave us the chance, he, we can show him better than we can tell him. You know, we got crazy writings, but we would would love to show, to sit down and show him, and to give him some of the things we created. Just to show that we really serious about it and that uh, we want to let, you know, let him know that we want to carry on. And we what is it that you're actually trying to do and what you want to do? Well, one of the things we wanted to find a way to try to crank back up the nature books, one, the physical copies. And what kind of creation you, what, what kind of creation you want to put out? Well, the first thing that we have, we have um, the smart watch that's based off of the way the smack circle was created by by your husband and it, it's a it's a preliminary watch but we have other designs but we made some red and black ones we wanted to make one for every color in the noop symbol which is red black green and um blue with the with the gray around it and and there's a lot of we got call i, I created a, a new food card game in 2010 i just haven't been able to find the right individuals that i can work with to put stuff out and then uh, a new created a, a game himself uh, that he want to try to get ready to put out.